I'm Suhair Mohyuddin. Uh, I come from Jordan. Uh, I'm here because um, I wanted to get more inspiration and to uh, actually exchange uh, with people who had already the experience of revolution because I knew that there were participants from uh, the MENA, I mean from North Africa and from Egypt. So uh, I, wanted, I came with all the curiosity and passion for their revolution because I also hope that uh, we will have ours. Mm -hmm. Um, it's a, a, a generous country, actually. People are very generous, um, are very kind uh, when you approach them after at least third time. <laughs> it's difficult, I mean, at the beginning it's really difficult. It's a, it's a complete um, a different culture. Uh, but then really with time, uh, it was really nice, I mean, to meet uh, those people and see that a lot of our, actually the most important thing is that our uh, uh, colleagues in the group, the Swedes, uh, share a lot of our concerns and they feel with us. That's, that was really beautiful. I think it, it is because um, if I will compare Sweden, I mean I've been here only for two weeks, but if I will compare what I've seen so far um, with uh, France or Spain uh, or uh, <laughs> Italy, um, Sweden is absolutely far, far more tolerant. From my conversations with my colleagues, uh, Swedish colleagues in the group, I understood that uh, the situation here in Sweden is much better than uh, in other countries in the world and that almost gender equality is the best. But I also realized that there are uh, a lot of feminists in Sweden and there is some kind of, um, let's say, a struggle, which means uh, that uh, there are still issues to solve and that the picture is not uh, perfect yet. Um, which means also for us that uh, we have to believe that we need time and that we have to be patient um, and that things takes time, uh, take time. Um, that's it. Um, I hope that will, there will be, um, that people will talk more uh, because this is also um, uh, what I got from coming here and being and seeing people and meeting people and doing an experimental uh, film. Uh, I realized that people re need to talk more because we cannot develop without tolerance, without accepting each other and knowing each other. Um, uh, development now in the Arab world is about uh, restoring our dignity, uh, but uh, when it comes to our relations with the West, uh, including Europe, and of which Sweden is part, people need to talk more and uh, need to get to know each other better. I hope, my hopes is that uh, in Europe and uh, uh, the perception of Arabs will change, will get much better and that people will take uh, the time and the energy to know more about us, to be more curious and take interest uh, than surrendering to the cliché.